Jolly Christmas, and in case you didn't hear, oh my golly, have a holly, jolly Christmas this year. What's up, guys, and welcome to the video. Today is Thursday, November 8th, I want to say. I'm so excited to be vlogging because I'm finally starting Christmas decorating. It may seem early to some people, but I don't care. I love Christmas. It's my favorite time of year. So I wanted to show you guys a couple things that I got today. Uh, and I'm gonna show you my new Christmas tree because I did get a new Christmas tree. People are probably gonna be like, why'd you get a new Christmas tree? You had an awesome tree last year. Well, I now live in an apartment and from this point forward, I will probably be in a bigger place than one room. So I went ahead and got a tree, so. I'm gonna show it. <laughs> oh, I went to Target, TJ Maxx, Walmart, and a couple other places, and I'm still in the process of decorating. It's literally just started, but this is kind of what my apartment <laughs> looks like right now. Um, so I went to Target and found some really, really cute stuff. Um, one of the things I found were these cute little white houses in the dollar section. They were only three bucks. I got three different sizes of them. They have a little spot in the back for a candle, which I thought was super cute and awesome. I'm gonna put them on shelves and stuff, but how cute are those? I loved them. So I got three of those for three bucks each. Um, they had some tape in the dollar section, so I just grabbed some for presents this year. They also had this table runner, which I loved. Clearly, this is uh, Sam's nephew's cute outfit that I got from TJ. I'll show you guys this in a second. But clearly you can see that I love this print. This was, I think, $3, and I think I'm gonna put it on the island somehow. I'm just starting to decorate this little thing, but I found this in there, and I believe this was $3 as well. So that's a table runner. They had really cute makeup pouches, and I had to get one because you can never have enough pouches, even if it was just like for your gym bag or like tampons or school or just to keep in your car. I thought that was awesome. Picked that up. They had some tissue paper, which you always need that. I feel like during Christmas time, you never know. It's just easy to have, and so I like the cheap price. So I picked that up. And then, let's see, what else did I get at Target? Um, I don't know. I think that's TJ Maxx. Got some envelopes because I need to ship some clothes that I sold. I'm just kinda gonna go random, but this stuff is from TJ Maxx. Uh, Sam's nephew is um, gonna be six months, so I just saw this when I was roaming TJ Maxx and I was like, I have to get this for him. So I picked this up for his nephew. Super cute little vest. I think this is nine months I got because I talked to his mom and she said she was getting ready to put away his three to six months stuff because he's about to be six months. So he can wear this in the future if it doesn't fit now. And then I had to get the booties because they matched and I love this print, clearly. What else? I got some Real Techniques sponges at TJ. These are my favorite sponges, so I really, really thought this was a good deal. I personally don't like the Beauty Blender. I have it and I hate it. I don't like it. These are my favorite. I like the big one of this too. I think the Real Techniques brand is way good and it's way cheaper, so I got four of them for $12.99. So I thought that was a good deal, yo. Sam got some chocolate for his dad, and that's his stuff, battery pop socket thingy. Uh, let's see. I got this tree from TJ Maxx. I love the snow dusted on top of it. I think that it's going to go great somewhere with all of my decor. So picked that up. It was only $12.99. They had a lot of different sizes too, so lots of options. Let's see. Mm, what else? It's bags. All right, I'll just show you guys the tree. So this tree is from Walmart and it is the number T38 because I know I'm gonna get asked. It was six and a half foot and it's pre-lit. I bought two extra things of lights which I'll show you guys here in a second but this is the tree. It is not fluffed yet so do not judge me for the blank spots but I think it goes with our decor really, really well. Excuse the pumpkin, it's going away. But I wanted a flocked tree. I did a poll and a lot of people said that they like green trees better, but I was like, well, I wanna try something different, and I have another tree that I'm gonna put in our bedroom, so I was like, whatever. I think that it'll look good with what I have, and I love white, so. That is my color. So here's the new tree. Gotta fluff it and decorate it, lots to do. As you can see, this is my Christmas bucket, and that is a fall bucket. 
another fall bucket, Christmas tree box. Uh, so we're basically just getting started. I want to point this out because I got asked on my Instagram where these were from. This is from Smallwood Homes, and I love their stuff as well as that Merry Christmas sign, which I don't know what I'm going to do with this yet. I got to go through it all before I show you all of my Christmas decor, but that's some of the stuff I got. And then like I told you guys that I picked up some extra miniature pre-lights, miniature lights, which is what is on my Christmas tree because I think that it needs more. And I like lit trees, really lit trees. What else? Okay, I wanted to show these because I have talked about these on Instagram before, but I don't think I've talked about them on YouTube yet. So here I am to talk about them. So, I don't know if you guys like Scentsies, but I absolutely love my Scentsies. I have three in my small apartment, and I use the ones from Walmart. These are all $2. They're the Better Homes and Gardens brand, and I just bought all the holiday ones that I liked. This one is Season of Joy. They smelled amazing. Uh, twinkling lights, festive twinkling lights, frosted air, fireside flurries, cookies for Santa. They smell so good. They're so cheap. They burn perfectly. I have one burning right now in our bedroom, and they're so easy to just slide the whole pan out, if you guys know what I mean. And I feel like they're cheaper than Scentsy for two bucks. I think Scentsy is like, I don't know. It's more expensive. I know that. So love those. I don't buy Scentsy anymore because of that. I bought a new gym bag today at TJ Maxx. I couldn't pass it up. Been looking for like a year for a new gym bag, but none of them have been like what I wanted. So I wanted a smaller one, but I needed it to be versatile. So this has a push thingy to, I can't do this with one hand, but it's really, really heavy duty. I don't know if you guys can see that from Adidas. I can show you guys this in case you wanted to look for it. It's the squad bucket pack, lifetime warranty. It was only $24.99, has tons of pockets, and it has, uh, Hang on, let me open this. It has a thing inside that says small stuff, sweaty stuff, so it's really, really nice. And it's like the perfect, once you open it up, there's like a lot of room on the bottom. And then it has the backpack style, which I like. I'm really excited for here. I wanna show you guys the bottom so you guys can see. It's not like your typical sling back. It's a little bit bigger and it's gonna be able to fit shoes, you know, all of my lifting equipment in here. So I had to pick that up and it's black, which is what I wanted besides my pink one. So yeah. And then last thing that I picked up from TJ Maxx today was, I'm gonna open only one of them because I got my mom one. You guys know that I love Ray Dunn, but I haven't really been hunting for it in quite some time because it's just too crazy for me with everybody who hunts it now, and I just don't care enough to fight for it anymore because I have a lot. So I can't wait to show you guys all my Christmas stuff that I did get last year that's currently being decorated, but I found Noel uh, spoon thingies. I love this. It just goes with all my Christmas decor really well. And I also picked one up for my mom because they had Noel and Jingle and we both wanted Noel. So yeah, that is what I got today. I think that that's everything to show you haul wise. Oh, I'll show you guys this other sign. I don't want to show you everything in my kitchen, but Meet Me Under the Mistletoe is also from Smallwood Homes. So yeah. And then I think what I'm gonna do is save the rest of my Christmas decor to show you guys when I have it done because it's not done yet at all like just open totes. And it's a lot different when you have a lot more to decorate than I did when I was, you know, in my condo or in my um, house with my roommates by myself. So I only had one room. So that's everything that's in the house right now in my little haul. Also wanted to show you guys these from Target. I talked about these on my Instagram last night, but they are garland, five bucks. I loved it, I got two of them. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them yet. I'm kind of just letting them hang out here because I kind of have an idea there, but I'm not sure yet. And then I also showed these stockings on Instagram as well. These are from TJ Maxx, I took the tag off, but they have the cute red plaid in there. So if you're interested in these, these are at TJ Maxx and I've seen them multiple times. They also have red ones and I think they have like an off white creamish color, but I wanted the white, so I picked that up.
All right, guys. So, just went to Hobby Lobby and I bought this basket for underneath of the tree. So it kind of gives it, I'm redoing this over here, but so it kind of gives it a different look. I really, really like it. The basket was 50 bucks, but it was 50% off, so 25. But that is the tree. And then I also picked up at Hobby Lobby. I'm gonna see how I what I think of these. But I got these pieces that have like, it's like white berry kind of. I hope you guys can see that the way I want you to see it. And I'm gonna see maybe on some shelves or on the tree. I don't know yet because it's a white tree, but these were also 50% off. So I got a couple of those. And then I got, I got this cute tree, which I hope you guys can see that well. I might have to go back and get a couple more. I really, really like it, the detailing on it. It's sparkly, it's the white, the green, all within my theme, so yeah. Today I am showing you a little bit more inside Christmas shopping, vlogging, life, what's going on with my tree. My mom is actually here today and we did some shopping. As you can see, my apartment is a freaking mess, but hopefully we're gonna get to work on it and get some stuff done. So here is the tree's current state. It's really, really um, random, but we're gonna add some of the stuff that I got. So here is the before, and I'm gonna show you guys what I picked up, and hopefully we'll be able to show you an after here in a little bit. This is kind of the disaster of shopping. Yeah. Hot Mass Express, but I'm just gonna go through and show you guys some of the things that I picked up. We went to Hobby Lobby, Home Goods, TJ Maxx, Target. We didn't end up at Walmart, but this is from Hobby Lobby. I'll just show you guys the things I got from there first. As you can see, I have like the metal houses that I showed you guys earlier in the video from Target. And then I saw this at Home Goods and I thought it was adorable. It actually has a candle in it, so it's battery operated. So I need to put some batteries in there, but it's so cute. I think it's, maybe it's gonna go in our bedroom. So that was super cute, $14.99. I love the tree that I got at TJ the other day, which is right there, so I had to pick up another one and copy my mom because she got two of these. They're like little balls. I really thought they were cute. I think this was $9.99, so not too terrible. Then I picked up this really cute throw. I needed to replace the gray one just for the holidays. I like to kind of coordinate colors. As you can see, it's red and white for Christmas, and we do have a lot of gray, obviously like with the rug and stuff, so I thought this was really, really fun and it would match well and it's super soft. So this brand, I'll show you guys quick, is the Max Studio brand and it was $19.99, so it's a pretty good size too, perfect for a couch or a chair of some sort. Moving on to TJ Maxx, I wanted this for over by our Christmas tree. There's like a, a Sam speaker box is sitting over there. So I wanted something to go on top of it. So I think this is gonna look great just sitting there. I don't know what I'm gonna put in it yet, but good size and it can be used throughout the year. This was only $9.99 and obviously it goes with my rustic -y farmhouse theme stuff. Found a Hustle mug from Ray Dunn. I have a couple of these, I really like them. I like the Hustle, so picked that up. Couple candles. This one is grapefruit balsam. I kind of thought that this wouldn't smell good, but it was actually awesome. And it has the plaid print, which is perfect for the holidays, Thanksgiving and Christmas. And yeah, smells really good. Some candle. And I saw this one the other day, and then with my mom there, I was like, does this smell good? And she thought so too, so I picked it up. It's kind of a giant, giant guy. It's a fireside. Fireside Natural Soy from the brand Sensational. It's huge, it has a snowflake on the top and it has the three, which I really, really love. I like burning these in our bedroom, so I picked that one up. I'm kind of going random now, but at Target, I found these flannel sheets. I love flannel sheets, and with our new lull mattress that we've had for a little bit, I wanted to pick up some flannels, and I thought the plaid was super cute. Not too holiday-ish, but not too uh, plain, so these can last us for the winter. Going over, oh, this is also from Hobby or Home Goods. I found a pie plate. I don't have any pie plates in my home at all, so I've never seen this before. So I grabbed that. 
pie plate. We also found two coffee canisters. I'll see if I can put the Snapchat or the Instagram story. I'll insert it right here if I have it to show you guys that I also found two coffee canisters and we found some other stuff. We must have got there right when they had a truck, but we picked this stuff up at Hobby Lobby. This is kind of my mom's theme. She helps out a ton with my decorating, obviously, and she has these in her own house. So we're going to mash, mesh, mesh this greenery with this like kind of wood. What would you say this is like? Wood, wood, cuteness. Twigs with pine cones, I don't know. Yeah, so we're going to mesh this with the greenery and it's gonna go in my bedroom in some form of sticking out of, I have a, I have a thing in there that says it is well with my soul and it had some florals in there from fall so we're just kind of switching it up. And this is from last Christmas. I can't decide if I wanna keep these. I don't really know what to do with them. I was kind of crazy last year and bought everything so that's that. What else? few things from TJ Maxx. These aren't really exciting, but these were $6.99 Chicago shirts, and you guys know my love for Chicago. So these were actually in the men's section. My mom found them and picked them up because they're super cute to go under like cardigans or tie up and work out in. That's that stuff. And then I'll take you over here to the Christmas stuff that we found. So my tree theme is going to be red and white and some greenery that I also picked up, which is all of those. I'll show you those first, I guess. I showed these, I believe... I believe I showed these earlier in the video, so I went and picked up more, and we're just gonna kind of fluff them into the tree. I really, really like it. I, my mom said this is called lamb's ear, so I don't know, I just, I really, really like it. And then these are for the top of the tree. They're going to go up at the top, we'll show you when we're done, but to come out of the tree, and then a ton of this holly berry, which is also going to go in the tree and poke out. It'll be easier once we do it and you can actually see it, but these are also gonna go out of the top of the tree. And then we have all of these new ornaments. So it's really difficult to find super good white ornaments, but Hobby Lobby had the plug. So these kind of have like a lace look to them and I thought that they would fit in really, really nicely. She's hanging one of the new ones right there, maybe. Trying. But the ones she's hanging right now are these ones. These were also from Hobby Lobby. Really, really cheap. Everything at Hobby Lobby was 50% off Christmas stuff. So just in case you were looking for some ornaments, these ones are the ones that she's working on right now. And then I picked up eight of these. I loved these. I really, really think that they're pretty. They have the sparkly, but they're not like too cutesy ornamenty. I don't know. We'll see. So we're gonna work on decorating the Christmas tree and we'll update you as we're doing it. She's the best at this kind of stuff, so that's why she's here. Oh, and also, I hung this stuff up yesterday. I told you guys that this was from Smallwood Homes, and these Target houses are freaking adorable, and I went back for more and they didn't have any, but these are the galvanized ones with the white snow top, and then there's also the white ones, which I have over here, but picked up this cute house from Hobby Lobby, and then these little green ones were there as well. So just kind of piece by piece, it's working its way together. So we'll update you when the tree is finished. Okay guys, so it's kind of dark, but I'm gonna show you the Christmas tree and what it looks like. I'll show you the rest of the house in a different video because I'm not quite done, but the shelf is pretty much done. So I thought I would share it and what my mom kind of put together. She definitely has full credit for this entire shelf. She took total control and just did it. So like I said, these are the houses from Target. I went back to get more today and there was none, so that's sad, but this one is the galvanized one, the metal, and this one is the white ceramic one. I know that it's bad to burn candles on the shelves, but they've been doing okay. I'm watching them, I'm aware of it, so before people give me crap. <laughs> um, these cute little trees are from Hobby Lobby. I'll turn on the light actually here in a second, but I just wanted to show you what it looked like in the dark. Those are just some cute little um, candle holders with bulbs in them, and then some ray down down here with a cute little wreath that is also from the Target dollar section. And then up here, just some cute trees and a candle. That's the candle I showed you guys earlier, the grapefruit balsam. And then you walk into the living room. There's my cute little throw. I have a silent night sign. I guess I can show you guys that. Silent night. And then I put 
my mom put the uh, pine-ish stuff over here in there with some ornaments and that's kind of what's over here and then my pride and joy is over here this is kind of a glimpse of the Christmas tree so put that basket right there like I had mentioned I am so in love with it I am literally so in love with it it's pretty much packed full of gorgeousness some people may think I'm crazy and be like why is that so exciting to you but Christmas is my favorite holiday I grew up loving it so being obsessed with my tree <laughs> is a big deal uh, this sign is from Smallwood Homes for like the third time but I know I'm gonna get asked and it's an amazing sign and they make the best signs so that's where I got that these shelves are from TJ Ma actually these are from home goods I got those in a previous video a while back we put some more of those brush trees up there around the house and this is also from Hobby Lobby so yeah I just wanted to show you guys the finished product so I think that I'm going well I'll show it to you guys in the light too just so you can see what it looks like the flock tree is definitely for me y'all I love it I'm just showing this in depth for people who may want ideas because I know I love seeing people's trees, so yeah. So that's what we're working with right now, and then I'll show you guys the rest of the house when I'm done. It's not quite done, but that's where we're at, so yeah. All right, guys, I think I'm going to wrap up this video here. I need to do some schoolwork and study a little bit, but I hope you guys enjoyed this kind of off nursing video I obviously am about to graduate nursing school so my videos will shift with me as my life goes on and I'm a nurse they'll still be nursing videos I promise but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this make sure you give it a thumbs up make sure you are subscribed and I will see you guys in the next video from me and my Christmas tree have a good one